Hey guys, how's it going? Not bad. Oh my god, I'm vlogging before we even walk out the door. Ah! Shit, got caught. <laughs> so yes, I did get caught on the door. These are one of the very few pants where the belt loops are just at the right level of the door. In the right place for me to actually get caught in them. Yeah, you guys don't normally see my house. Because I'm normally vlogging somewhere else. But... I don't know, I decided to go ahead and pull up the camera beforehand. I'll probably get more once I'm actually on the freeway. <laughs> I want to show you guys how beautiful it is out right now. Look at that. Ohio. I don't know, it's amazing out here sometimes. I'll see you guys in a minute. I'm back. Wait, no, get away, get away, get away. Yeah, so I was gonna go to. I'm gonna grab this window. I was gonna go to McDonald's so I can get something to eat since I have five dollars left and I get paid tomorrow. Yes, baby. <laughs> That's gone. Just that quick. Unless I had five dollars, I figured I'd go grab something to eat because I normally don't eat before work or when I'm at work because I'm too sleepy. So I'm like, grab a couple of little cheeseburgers and a coffee. Out. I pulled in and pulled right out because it was just like man there's like so many people it's like I know it's around one o'clock but for God's sake does everybody gotta go to the same McDonald's there's some people who are on their way to work who want to get a bite to eat come on go to some place like Subway or Good, like Jimmy John's or even Five Guys Burgers, for God's sake. Don't go to my McDonald's. <laughs> I'm just ranting now. Yeah. It's like that no matter what day you go. It doesn't matter if it's a Thursday, a Friday, a Sunday, a Monday. 24 hours. Well, it's not open 24 hours, but the whole time it's open, there's always a line wrapped around the building. And I'm thinking to myself, wait, you're supposed to be fast food? But... You have 20 people in line, and the line's not moving. The line should be only from the end of the line to the speaker. There should not be a line between the speaker and the beginning of the line. Because it's fast food, for God's sake. It's fast. It's supposed to be fast. I actually waited at McDonald's one time for 15 fucking minutes. I'm not joking. 15 minutes. All I wanted were... Well, normally what I get was like two McDoubles, a coffee, and sometimes I get like an ice cream sundae or something. Not a hard order. Sometimes I throw some fries in there, but <clears throat> depends on... I'm feeling that day. And I figure, okay, the fries are done in about three minutes. As soon as I get they get the order, they should be dropping fries. Okay. How long does it take to make a freaking McDouble? 35 seconds, pull the burger out, pop it on, squirt, squirt, throw some ends on. I mean, come on, it's not hard. <laughs> I can get rid of this cough already. But, um, for God's sake, fast food, make it faster. I know you guys want to make fresh food. I don't care if my double McDoubles have been sitting there for 10, 15 minutes. Just put them in my bag. As long as they're hot, I don't care. Okay, for those people who want fresh, you should ask them, would you like that fresh or not? They say no like me, fucking give me my food and let me go. So, yep, that's my bitch grabbing complaint for today. <laughs> I'm just heading down the road, trying to get some trucks and stuff, and a big truck. Well, whatever they're hauling. That's why I always wonder big trucks, what are they hauling? Like this guy. Who knows what's in there? Who knows? Only the driver, the driver's company, and a company receiving the load does. Like, there's more. Now, you know the other ones, like the one way down there, I'm not sure if you see it yet. 
There we go. Save a lot. You know where that's going. You know what's in that truck. It's just these trucks that you don't know what are in them are always interesting. And look at these people. I mean, pressing. I'm giving the guy in front of me a little bit of room. The guy behind me is right on my tailgate. For God's sake, give me a little bit of room. Good thing this last truck, the save lot truck, is passing by. I'm just going to go ahead and get it all on over. There. Now I feel a little more comfortable. And the guy fucking pulls right behind me. Motherfucker. Oh well. This isn't going to be a good day. <laughs> get people riding my ass. And, I mean, I'm going to the speed limit. I should slow down a little bit. <laughs> there we go. I'm going, like, four or five miles under the speed limit. <laughs> I know, I'm an asshole. But, people, come on. Do not ride the ass of the person in front of you. It is dangerous. It is not funny. It is not cool. It is... I mean, if I were to slam on my brakes with that person behind me, they would owe me a mint. Because, I mean, I mean I'm mean, i well insured and everything. The truck's insured past what it's worth. But, hell, I can see them out the wazoo. But, that's beside the So, guys, if you come to Ohio and you see a wonderful Green Ranger with a weird guy behind the weird wheel or... Yeah, anyways, just do not ride my ass. I will slam on your, my brakes. <laughs> and you will owe me some money. But... Finally, the person ended up being in the left lane anyways to get off of on 80 instead of like I am doing and getting on 680. So, the only thing I have to do is I would give you the middle finger, but I need at least one hand to drive. <laughs> so, guys, I'll probably talk to you later. Probably more film downtown because there's something going on. Something. I'll figure it out. <sighs> well, I'll talk to you guys later. Jump. Reverse. <laughs> Jump. I'll pass. What you guys see? They have everything set up. The Ferris wheel, which is about as high as we are. God, they got even a kid slide, and they're all the way down the freaking lane. <laughs>